Puppy Panda Gamer here. Today I am playing Five Nights at Freddy's. I haven't seen too much about it so that I could scare myself, but I've seen a few videos to know that I'm going to be scared out of my pants. Quite literally. I'm wearing pants. Let's begin. Not responsible for injury or dismemberment. Hello? Hello? Uh, I wanted to record a message for you to help you get settled in on your first night. Um, I actually worked in that office before you. I'm finishing up my last week now, as a matter of fact, so I know it can be a bit overwhelming, but I'm trying to tell you there's nothing to worry about. Uh, you'll be fine. Hey. Welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. It's a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike. But there's really nothing to worry about. Uh, the animatronic characters here do get a bit quirky at night. Uh, they're left in some kind of free-roaming mode at night. Uh, something about their servos locking up if they get turned off for too long. Uh, now concerning your safety, the only real risk to you as a night watchman here, if any, is the fact that these characters, uh, if they happen to see you after hours, probably won't recognize you as a person. They'll, they'll most likely see you as a metal endoskeleton without its costume on. Now, since that's against the rules here at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, they'll probably try to forcefully stuff you inside a Freddy Fazbear suit. Um, now, that wouldn't be so bad when you touch his nose, it goes wee, wee. That will be tomorrow. Uh, check those cameras and remember to close the doors only if absolutely necessary. Gotta conserve power. Alright, good night. I wasn't listening to the guy on the telephone. Just because I wasn't listening, I just figured out that the nose goes weak. These people are scary. I do like the music, though. What? No. I know that Foxy comes out on the left side. I'm just gonna keep checking the left side. 